Hey guys, happy Friday. Um, I am spending my evening in and I am making some all-purpose healing salve. So basically, it's actually an immune boosting all-purpose healing salve. Um, it's only a few ingredients. It's really easy. Everyone loves it. It's so helpful and it's useful for everything. Um, for dry skin, especially in the winter. Um, not only that, but it has On Guard, so it'll help boost your immune system. And Rosemary, which will um, help open up the airways. So if you're dealing with any kind of congestion or anything, it can also help with that as well. So it really is like an all-in-one. So you only need um, a few ingredients. You need your coconut oil, so I've got mine there. You just need some olive oil, which I'm sure some of you guys might have all of this in your house already. Coconut oil, olive oil, some beeswax, and a little bit of vitamin E oil, which is optional, but I like to add it in. And then your essential oils. So, like I said, I'm using On Guard, which is going to help boost your immune system. So, I'm not only using it for your skin or anything like that, it'll also help with that kind of thing. So, if you want to use this daily, um, sometimes I use it as like a lip balm. It really helps a lot. And then lavender. Lavender is to soothe the skin. Um, it's really healing for any kind of redness, irritation, dryness, burns, scars, uh, pretty much everything. So lavender is like an all-in-one. Rosemary. Rosemary is amazing. It smells great. And it also is um, really good at opening up the airways. <clears throat> so if you're dealing with any like chest congestion or anything, you could rub this salve on your chest. And it will help um, open up your airways, help you breathe, also boost your immune system. So, everything. And then last but not least, my favorite, frankincense. So, frankincense, um, if you don't know by now, is the best thing ever, and I'm obsessed with it. But frankincense is the king of oils. Frankincense is good for everything. It will, will not only boost your immune system, but it will um, help the skin heal as well. Help your body on a systemic, whole cellular level. So, frankincense is something that's always good to have in anything you have. So, just those ingredients... I don't know if you can see here. Oh, yeah, you can see. I don't have, like, a double boiler officially or anything. So, basically, mine is just a little pan with water and a glass measuring bowl. I'm not fancy when it comes to this. I'm a little ghetto, I guess, in the kitchen, but whatever. Hey, Lucy. Um, so, I have everything in here. I add the olive oil, the coconut oil, um, the beeswax into my measuring cup. And I have it sitting in here so they can melt. So right now the beeswax and the coconut oil um, are still melting. So it'll probably be just maybe about 10 minutes more. And then whenever it is completely melted, I will add it. I will add my essential oils into that actually. And add it to some glass jars. I have a couple of these as well as some other stuff. Um, and there you go. And it's good. It'll last you for one year. So it's great. And it's even greater when um, you stick it in the fridge. So when you put it on, it's nice and cool. Um, I really like that a lot. So, I, oh yeah, and as far as how many drops of each oil you want to do, um, really I like to do 5 to 10. It just really depends. If you're going to be using it on children or like young um, young people or even like the elderly or people with sensitive skin, you want to go with a lighter um, amount of oils, amount of drops. But I like to go usually around 8 or so per oil. So yeah, that is how you make a salve, and I'll show you guys the results when I'm done. Bye. Bye, Lucy. Sadie says hi. <laughs>